What's up guys? Welcome back to, this, to another icy video of Horizon. Alright, so last episode we talked about how I went through, I was going to go through all these shops and pretty, pretty much go through these and just handle all the business, right? Alright, I have done that. I learned a few things. Let me show you. Number one, the, uh, let's see how I can remember his name, which I already know I cannot. The fire billow mark, billow back, is being this freeze. So freeze arrows, which I did actually buy. Uh, I bought some frozen arrows, thinking that I could just use these. And, no, I can't, no. Um, in order to use this bow and an electric bow, I have to have a war bow. Now, keep that in mind. So the war bow is all right. It can fire both of them. I'm pretty sure a third one, if I find it right. Um, you can do that. Let me see if I can go back to him. All right, so I'll just run and talk while I go. So pretty much, I'll talk to you. Wait, you may, you do not have one Okay, so pretty much I need a war bow, which you, if you remember like the very first episode or second, um, you remember like the first or second episode, I actually had a war bow, but it was not uh what it can only shoot electric arrows which was okay but for a war bow that can shoot electric and ice i war bow of at least a kaja which is this one now the cost is not that great it's the fact that i don't have the desert glass or the slag shine glass which is pretty much the main two things I need. Um, but otherwise, uh, I can actually, don't know what else I can, I can actually get rid of this now, right? You're the, no, not you, this, I can get rid of this. So the reason I got rid of that is because I got this purple one with the Shadow Hunter which is a step up from that same bow and shoots the same arrows. So now I need to go find a war bow or get the stuff for the war bow. And I can actually start firing free ice arrows and electric arrows for the bellow back, which I can actually handle them a lot better now. Now, now the thing is, I actually should, Look at the outfits, actually. I'm a silent, I'm a silent. Two watcher lens, right? Oh wait, I already have this. What this one? A billow back heart. Now, funny thing is, old dude bro sells components like these. So like I can actually buy a billow back heart off of him. The problem is, um, should I just kind of do that now? I don't even have to fight the bell back. I can actually. Okay, I'm just gonna do that now. Uh, who was it? You? Hmm, yes. I. Did you find the vessels I seek? No, it was not you. Yes, yes. Trade quickly. I have work to do. Oh, catch the trades. Oh, but nothing good. Okay. Uh, I will leave you to the hunt. Okay. Be sure so ruins. Perhaps you're merchants. Okay. Spells. Sales. Not spells. Machine resources. The travels have taken you through ancient ruins. Right. Okay. Let us speak of it. So he sells the stuff that um, that I will need. Leave the rest. You'll like what I have. You'll like what I have for sale. Uh, this yeah. Okay. Now he actually has a Bella Bark heart. Yeah. Okay. 
so I can at least buy this, right? Uh, now for right now, what is this? A middle vessel. Can go ahead and sell all this. So what I need to do is pretty much go back through and um, sell, sell stuff that I don't need. Metal burn. This is for. Watch your heart. I uh, don't need this at the moment. I definitely need my Bella Bark. And that's crazy. I bought that for seven hundred um dollars and it's like dude. I can sell it back for seventy six. That is insane. Okay. Frozen freeze Bella back and fire Bella back. Stalker lands, I can sell you, right? Okay. Uh, Blaze, I don't really need to sell you. Okay, so, uh, uh, the same. And now, I can uh, sell you. Alright, so. So now, if I just bring up $100, $800, I can actually go get an upgraded suit, which will protect me more and. I'll be, I'll still be a silent hunter pretty much. Now, we're actually gonna go for, instead of going for main quest, I'm actually gonna go for um, side quest. Cause I actually got, I racked up like a lot. Three, four, five, six. We got a lot, we got a lot of stuff. We can at least go do, right? So I actually gotta go with the closest man, is Robin the Witch. Right, okay. And we actually gonna. So I guess this episode is more gonna be about side quests and actually trying to farm a little bit. Uh. Although, like, yes, I wanted to stay on the main quest for the most part, but you know, if I can make that easier by, you know, having better equipment and arrows, bows, actually learning a lot of stuff. Then it's like, oh, okay. I can actually, you know, do better. And some drops of blood leading away. Find goods for a fair price. Ooh, it's bleeding a lot, and nobody stopped this man. More blood. I'm still on the trail. So you don't remember, you got new bow, you got a new type hard point. Oh, uh, call the here. Someone must have seen the thief. You. Did like someone run past oh. here, holding a sword? Sure did. He grabbed some linen off the stand here and took off down the stairs behind you. He was bleeding, so maybe he needed a binding. Blast it! That was expensive cloth. I can't believe I pay bandage. <laughs> Alright. These are good. But yeah. Uh, new bow, stronger arrow. That's a very uh, which is like um, way, there's only one way he could have gone. Forward. Yeah, a lot more damage and uh, Um, shatter thing, right? But how much is and it's pretty much the same stuff, just a little more costly than the normal. So I don't even have to make the normal anymore. Uh, so pretty much normal arrows upgraded as well, and they're both upgraded, also good. Uh, so now I wanna, what I wanna do is I wanna buy a war bow this episode, I wanna get the new suit this episode and I want to get most of these quests done in this one episode. Someone so must have seen him go by. I'm gonna move on. Okay. Oh, wait. Did you see any through here? He would have been holding a sword. 
Yeah. So. Almost crashed into me, too. He ran down the parapet here and went down the lift. No way he'll catch him now. I didn't see a sword, though. He wasn't carrying anything. Not a damn thing. Just ran like his ass was on fire. The thief must have ditched the sword. But where? Maybe he had help. That merchant stall would have been a convenient drop-off. Let's go protect them, Stalin. Find goods for a fair price here. We've got laws here. Just a friendly reminder, stranger. Don't pass up these goods. It looks like the thief got away, but without the sword. I thought maybe he dropped it off somewhere. Like here, for instance? What? No. I had nothing to do with this. I guess we'll see when I get the city guard to toss your stall and question your customers. Uh, hold on. There's more to this. Wow. You've got a reputation for a shining light in the darkness, so I know you'll listen. You're right. The sword was passed to me, and I passed it on to someone else. It's going to be sold, but not for profit. The shards will go to people in need. You I expect me that. to believe that? I really don't believe I can that. prove it. Meet my friends at the water mill in the lower village. They'll explain everything. If they don't convince you, come right back with the guards. I'm not going anywhere. It wouldn't matter if you did. I'd find you. But all right. I'll check out the water mill. Okay. Right. I guess I should go to this water mill then to find out what's going on. Hi yeah. You can come and go all around the world just to find your friends nicely. Alright. Uh, don't know what else to talk about now. Okay. I hear King of Odd is afraid he might I start collecting a lot more. And use levers. Right. Don't know why I thought uh, like an electric elevator. No. No, gears. Okay, he is coming up. I hear it. Is it? Oh, Jesus, that took a long time. Let's go. Might as well. Fine goods for a fair price. These aren't well, goods. Fine better They're necessities. I don't believe that they sell the same stuff. No, they don't. Okay. Even though I got enough, no, so I still need the desert glasses. Which I'm pretty sure I can only get by looting off of people, right? Taking side hunter. Right, okay. Um don't need to buy anything else to be honest with you. And I don't have anything else to sell just as yet. Metal bot here, good prices, fair prices. Fairest prices for machine parts under the Mesa. No tithes to the Sun Court. Not like those greedy snarls upside. She's not interested in taxes. I know what she's not interested in. As I was saying, no better offer for snap ball lenses. I'd give my oath on it. By the sun, don't start spitting in your palm. 
Huntress, I apologize on behalf of my partner, Silent Partner. <laughs> Silent Partner? <laughs> if the sun would only grant my prayers. Never mind snap more lenses, Huntress. There's no market for those. A long leg lens, though, you'd be well rewarded for. I can see that you're busy. Wait, wait. You drove her off. Snap Ma Lens, what do you say? I drove her off? <laughs> That's rich. Listen, Huntress, long leg lens. Hunters, scroungers, brittle. Uh, so I guess Scrubbers, I can try what to kind of brutes either. are you trying to How would I get a long leg lens? I don't even know if I kill them, right? These aren't goods. Like, realistically speaking, I cannot even kill them. Come take a look, look at these words. Words. price. His father said. Okay. Won't find better way. We have one more. Oh, yeah. Told my my family I might still be alive, and you're going to stand here and do nothing? Oh, sorry. Okay. Tell me what happened to your family. Maybe I can help. Fear they are all dead by now. I barely escaped alive. Machines. Vicious machines attacked my family's estate. Father sent me to get help. See you later. I'll see what I can do about the estate. You will? Oh, thank you. Oh, please, be careful. Those machines are deadly. This, uh, this window. I think this is very protective here. I got stuck by now. Uh, how about the Disney? Definitely awake now. There, there's another thing right here. Another town, Jesus. Okay. No, not at all. I was told to expect you, Aloy. I suppose you want answers. Well, complicated. We collect valuable objects from people who don't need them, sell them for shards, and use the money to help the needy at Sunfall. You mean you steal? If you want to call it that. From hogs who've had their turn at the trough for generations. Ravon didn't seem like a hog to me. He stinks just like the rest of them. Wow. Of wealth and contentment. While people beneath him suffer. Who exactly gets the shards at Sunfall? Not the bastards in the fortress. We use the shards to make sure the poor in Shadowside get to eat. Or bandage their wounds. They only went west because they had to. Trust me, I know. My wife was chained up with a bunch of servants and herded with them. They starved to death, still bound together. I'm sorry. So am I. Dang, that's harsh. Where's the sword now? Safe. I haven't sold it yet. 
So what now? What do you expect me to do now? Walk away? I was hoping you'd help us. They say you can track like a stalker. Well, my partner, Nassan, disappeared near the branded shore. He was bound for Sunfall, along with an entire shipment of food. If you found that, you'd be helping a lot of people. I'll consider it. But only if you return the sword to Ravon. I knew you were gonna say that. Fine, I'll return the damn blade. Ravon was supposed to meet his contact at an old campfire on the fork near the branded shore. Start looking there. Be careful. Lots of machines out there, and lots of Shadow Karja. And not the needy kind, but they're tormentors. Mm. Don't let your guard down. Say the last. Ha! Oh. That is so far. Oh, my lord. You're gonna need a starter. guys i'm gonna come back when i actually get there okay guys let's not start back the video now oh i just ran through so much territories there was so many snapbacks snap moms where are they there's a long leg you're a long leg long leg not a tall neck Two different things, right? Okay, interesting. All right. Anyway, I'm only 200 ways away. Okay. Let's have. That's over with. Thanks for the help. Oh, well, I'm going. Like, dang, they get damaged by something. Come on over here and have a word. Where are you? I'm going. What's up, brother? What are you doing out here all alone? Oh, where are your whoops, men? that's the main mission. I'm not gonna risk their lives. I don't mind putting my worthless ass on the line, but not theirs. Sorry I had to drag you into it. Uh, don't worry. This is just an average day for me. You know, take down some machines, track some killers. Right. I'd hate to see a busy morning for you. Ready to get started? Tell me exactly what happened to Ursa. Start from the beginning. Yeah, I will do well, another mission. Sure. This episode said she left like in us. the middle of That's the night a with a few of her best men. Her best men? But she didn't bring you? No. I'd been drinking a lot. You know, maybe she thought... Ah, oh, damn, I don't know. I couldn't hack it. Search parties found their bodies the next day and the corpses of some Shadow Karja cowards. It was an ambush. The Shadow Karja... They, they beat her so bad we can't even show her face before burial. Oh, I'm so sorry, Erend. Yeah, well, when I find the soldiers who did this, they'll be sorry too. You don't have any idea why she left in the middle of the night? No, but it must have been urgent. A message, a report of some new Shadow Karja threat, I don't know. Okay. Why would the Shadow Karja do this? 
Because they hate us. And Ursa most of all. She teamed up with Avad to kick their asses out of Meridian. They've been licking their wounds for two years, but... They finally found a way to get back at her. Didn't want me in the guys, I'm sorry. Still up if you are. <laughs> okay, put that right there. All right, back to this. Are you sure you're all right? Well, I'm sober, so no. Well, I'm glad you're thinking straight at least. Don't get used to it. All right. Show me where Ursa fell, and I'll do what I can to help. Come on, follow me. All right, so... Why would Ursa come all the way out here? I don't know. It doesn't make sense. Is this Shadow Karja territory? No. They broke the ceasefire as soon as they set foot in the cliff. Okay, okay. Change of plans, but I mean, I'm down with it. Didn't realize it was him who was in. I did. I thought it was funny when it's like, oh Where's no, a random NPC is by themselves. They need help. No, it's the main mission. That was the main mission. I'm pretty sure he wouldn't have died either. If I actually just left him. Hey, this is it. Where the ambush happened. Our soldiers have been over it, but maybe that fancy spirit. artifact of yours there can find a clue or something. Armor. Please. These look like dragon bloodstains, and not the crack arrows scattered there. Okay. It's perfectly sharp. Never seen action. Is she what she look like? Oh. They look like snakes. Mm. They look good as new. Never fired. Fire. Did someone? Move a body through here. What do you see there? The stain forms a line, as if blood dripped off the edge of something, like a cart. See, cart tracks. I think someone moved the bodies here, then scattered them across the field. Wait, are you saying the dead found here were killed somewhere else? But why would the Shadow Karja do that? At this point. I'm not taking Shadow Karja responsible. Of course they were. Well, let's follow these tracks and find out. Oh no. Oh, dude, bro. Seems a little suspicious. Like, not, okay, not suspicious in that way, but it's like. He just got suspiciously hostile. Interesting. I mean, he, he doesn't look like the type to. I can't remember. He doesn't look like the type to like do something like this either. <laughs> they really went all the way up here. Just a quick save. I don't like, wait, where did he go to? Alright, let's keep going. I get why they wanted Ursa dead. But why fake an ambush? There's more to this. And we're gonna figure it out. 
feel like this is an inside job. So, somehow, this was an inside job. I promise you. should be up here. These guys aren't Shadow Karja. They're from my tribe, the Asaram. Is this how your people usually greet each other? Help me, fool! Ugh. Oh, dude, oh, dude. I think it's calling What's in machines. That? Get ready. Asaram, not Shadow Karja. Looks like I was wrong about everything, as usual. Please, 
Use that second sight of yours. I have to know what really happened. I'm on it. Pick up, bye bye. First, eat. Come on, nice, nice, nice. All this stuff I can get. Oh, uh, where's the other one at? Over here. What are those leather straps? Those rocks are shattered. Something hit these stones. Something I've never seen before. Armor straps, cut with a knife. Like you could mount some equipment on that thing. There, by the tripod, a used power cell. Look like vanguard weapons. A lot of people died here. A massacre. This is Ursus' helmet. I thought she died in the field below, but it must have been here. All this trickery. For what? Feels like it's just a torch in me. For real. I have a theory. But it takes a little imagination. Theories are better than other people's fears. Tell me! All right. I think the Asaram ambushed Ursa and her men with a new weapon. They mounted it on that tripod up there. It fires waves of force, maybe sound. Looks like it cracked the stone there. I think it paralyzes people instead of killing them. It dropped the vanguard right there. No blood on their weapons. No fight. But why paralyze them if you're only gonna move them and gut them? They were trying to hide something. Look here, a bloody rock. That they used to smash Ursus' face in. Or someone else's. These leather straps have been cut. As if they took the armor off someone. Uh, that, that can't be. Her body is, is lying in state in Meridian. I saw it. You said she was unrecognizable. Maybe they switched another body into her armor, someone around the same size, and mutilated it enough so it could have been anyone, even Ursa. 
go back to Meridian. Take another look at that body. If it's really Ursa, of course I'm wrong. But if I'm right... Then, then my sister could be alive. I, I, I'm going. Meet me back there when you can. Did she fake her death? Yo, did she fake her death though? Fork of the road is somewhere around here. Let's see, it came up here. I think it's somewhere near the smoke, isn't it? Uh, no, I don't know. Tell you what. Find Owen. Right here. He's on the other side of this um, campfire. I look. Oh, oh, oh. Whoopsie. He's right there. But I am uh, got a campfire right there, so we're actually just going to fast travel here. Now fast travel here and then I'm fast travel back and we have enough time afterwards, okay? Yo, plot twist though. That's amazing. So it would be interesting if she actually faked her own death though. That would be cool. <sighs> Sorry, I'm a little tired. It's 2 a.m. right now, and it's like I'm so very tired. Check my phone real quick. Uh, no, she went to sleep. That's unfortunate. That's very unfortunate. Again. Hey, yeah. I haven't had a break. A light turn. Gonna keep that just in case. This yet, so I'm gonna get rid of this. Chill ward on here. I'm gonna need, I'm gonna need that. Um, I know I need that. Uh, don't think I need this. So now I can actually go and buy. Bam. Yeah, see, see how it doesn't say modify weapons or outfit right now. It just says weapons and outfit. So I need to learn like not where I, I can actually do that. But it's decent work. Every time. And also, do you think there'll be more? Like I can put skills in. Like upping my health bar or something, or I 
that's cool. That's cool. This is gonna be good. So I'm gonna say that for me. I really want that. I definitely need that. So I need to actually start taking down some of these bigger things since I'm getting to that kind of stage in the game. I uh, need to be able to handle that. So, uh, pretty much been. I mean, you see me bear roll. I'll be doing that a lot. Greetings, Aloy. I am known as Blameless Mirad. Please come with me. You're needed for an important consultation. What do you mean? Where's Erend? He's inside, attending the Sun King, where we should be without further delay. Follow me, please. All of these people are here to see the Sun King. Yes, and each has come to ask a favor of him. Unpleasant, thanks. The Sun King is eager to meet you. The machine tamer with a curious eye for detail. It's all very intriguing. I'm not here to intrigue you. Too late. First the Oseram get special treatment, and now outlanders from the savage interest of the Sun King having her. Passed by some outlander woman? Unacceptable. I Nothing can get out when this Nora goes to the front of the line. Ignore them. Nobles are like children who whine when they don't get a second helping of dessert. I can see this being a, a higher up class in a lower class society. The most important society. thing is what he isn't like. His father. I think you'll find him to be a reasonable man. Aloy of the Nora. Mm. She who sees the unseen. Welcome. It would seem you have done me a great service. Erend, tell her what you found. I, I checked Ursa's tomb. You were right, Aloy. The body is missing a scar below her right knee. I gave it to Ursa when we were kids, fighting over a toy sword. If the body is not Ursa's, then we must assume she is still alive. And I will not abandon her. We only know she was taken, not who took her. I can help with that. Ursa has an enemy among the Osara, a warlord named Durval. Impossible. Every clan in the claim has been hunting for him since the liberation. He has to be dead by now. No other no. Osara had the motive and ingenuity to lure Ursa into this trap. I expect to find him lurking somewhere near the border. I've already sent an agent to investigate. He'll be waiting for word from us at the marketplace in Pitchcliff. I can't move troops to the border without provoking the Osara, but I could send a few vanguardsmen. And perhaps an exceptionally gifted Nora as well. Heck yeah. Errant, Murat. Let me discuss it with her privately. He se he seems cool. But what I hate is to he? impose further after all you've done, but this is a matter of great importance to me. It sounds like Ursa means a lot to you. Without her Asaram Vanguard, I would not have been able to liberate Meridian and end my father's brutal reign. Since then, it has been difficult to maintain peace between our tribes. But Ursa has a way of making her people see reason. So you see, I need her back at my side. And quickly. Who is Durval, exactly? To understand Durval, you must first understand my father. He truly thought of himself as a sun god. His mm. mind was broken. Broken. He believed that blood sacrifice would solve, well, everything. So he raided the other tribes for victims, especially the Asaran. Durval fought back. He crafted powerful weapons and rallied his people. My father responded with the ultimate cruelty. He captured Durval's wife and daughter and sacrificed them in the Sun Ring. Oh, dear Jesus. 
Oh my god, that's it. I'd like to ask you something about the Sundom and its politics. By all means. So, why would Durval go to so much trouble to kidnap Ursa? He felt she betrayed him. She fought by his side until she realized he planned to raise Meridian and butcher its people. Oof. And she came to me. Together, we stopped him and liberated the city from my father. Durval has spent every moment since trying to get revenge. Mostly on the other Asuram who fought with us. He oh, that's so many spot. powerful enemies. Oh, okay. Oh, they didn't the kill rest him. Of him. Interesting. I was wrong. Wait, so it is for okay, so for what I understand it, the king was a tyrant and him and her overthrew him. Is is his name the that's the ball. I'd like to name. ask you something about the Sundom and its politics. Okay. By all means. They call you a sun god who killed his own father in order to unite the tribes in harmony. Is any of it true? They say you can see the invisible, split an arrow at 50 paces, and tame machines at a glance. How much of that is true? It's not too far off. Well, I would like to unite the tribes in harmony, but you saw how many courtiers I have to deal with first. Maybe next week. Okay. Quite a place you've got here. You can almost see the little people below the mesa. You don't approve? Well, I have a secret for you. Neither do I. But we must be patient. Change won't come in a single sunrise. But will it happen at all, while men live in palaces? It might. Eventually. If people like you help me bring it about. Okay. Your politics seem very complicated. The Asaram are friends, but enemies too? I couldn't have liberated Meridian without the help of Ursa and her Asaram freebooters. Many of them have settled here. But the Eldermen of the Asaram clans in the claim have become jealous of their success. So have many Karja nobles. It's a volatile situation, especially given the fact that my father raided the Asaram for years. Ursa helps keep the peace, promising a future based on mutual gain. But some, like Durval, will never let go of their venom. The father did die. Duval is pretty much the leader of uh, the Osram, and the king killed Duval's wife and child, and now he's taking revenge. Gotcha. What can you tell me about the Shadow Karja? What do they have to do with Ursa? They are remnants of my father's regime, holding out at the fortress of Sunfall to the west. Like him, they care only for domination and seek to draw upon the power of the sun by spilling blood in its name. Okay. Since okay. Ursa helped me take this city from them, they were perfect scapegoats. Durval knew this, of course, and planned it well. Okay. I need to get going. I know. Well, they say kings should never beg. But please. Help me find Ursa. Who says that? Well, Murad, for one. Don't hesitate to ask him or Erend if you have other questions. Say, lives. Okay. All right. So, what are we looking at here?
yeah, go through the portal. Now yeah, with this, yep, let's see right there. I can just teleport. Alright, so people pretty much gonna end this. I wanna end with this mission right here. So the video won't be hopefully won't be too long. I know I gotta edit uh the initial run towards the you know all, all the way up there before I got diverted to the main mission. So hopefully the video won't be too long. Or well actually tell me in the comments below, do you guys even want me to like show side quest? I assume you do want to see like the entirety of the game and not just the main mission. Must be where Masan was supposed to check in. Right, let's actually say quick save real quick. It looks like there was a scuffle here. But no but if someone dragged Masan off, there should be tracks. Oh, here we are. Let's see where they went. Alright, let's go. stayed up here. Shadow Carja outpost. Let's hope Nassan is inside. You can see them, Left. they can't Man see down. it.
someone to take my oh, arm. Yeah. I'll be a perfect time. Did not see him right there. Surprised I'm even able to scavenge that. Oh my god, this is gonna be so hard. It's gonna be so hard to do. Back to position. Don't get lazy. I'm going to check that out. And the summer kills. Sandstorm right now, damn. Okay. I can do this. I can do this. So they pretty much literally made a sneak you know, around the entire place. Cause for some reason they are they are terrible at doing the job. They're not even wrong. To keep okay. 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 a shadow must pass over it.
Ok, c'est tout bon. Ah, il est tout droit. Got Nassan, all right. He needs help. Let's try this again. I'll keep it simple since you're obviously feeble. What were you doing out by the fork? It was a picnic with your mother. I think he's trying to hurt your feelings. Won't work. My mother loves a good picnic. Be that as it may, we're not getting anywhere. That's all right. I don't mind breaking a few of his bones. How many do you think we'll have to crack to make him squeal? Hmm, he's got spirit. Mike. All right. I'm taking wagers. Hmm? Fools and filth have teamed up to run Meridian. That'd be a cleansing. Let's try this again. I'll keep it simple since you're obviously feeble. What were you doing out by the fork? It was a picnic with your mother. I think he's trying to hurt your feelings. Won't work. My mother loves a good picnic. Be that as it may, we're not getting anywhere. That's all right. I don't mind breaking a few of his bones. How many do you think we'll have to crack to make him squeal? Hmm, he's got spirit. Might take seven. All right. I'm taking wagers. Hmm? True Kaja. Dang. Okay. All right. So what are we going for? They've gotten a son, all right. He needs help. Let's try this again. Those usurpers in Meridian. I'll keep it simple, since you're obviously us. feeble. We'll show them. What were you doing out by the fork? It was a picnic. With your mother. I think he's trying to hurt your feelings. Won't work. My mother loves a good picnic. Be that as it may, we're not getting anywhere. Heard something That's above. Fine. I don't mind breaking a few of his bones. How many do you think we'll have to crack to make him squeal? Hmm, he's got spirit. Might take seven. All right. I'm taking wagers. Hmm? Okay. Yeah! Yo, he didn't even give me a notification for that. Nice. Okay. Keep it simple. Hardly a hit. Trip me. Ah! Let this impale the 
enemy. Kinjeev sent me. Let's get you out of here. I thought that old salt had abandoned me. Guess I owe him a slap on the back. Come on, this way. Kindeev told me about the cause. Did you lose the shipment? No. It's hidden nearby. There's a lot of hungry people in Sunfall that will be happy to see it. Good. Now, listen. When you head back to Meridian, talk to a noble named Ravon. If you're honest with him, I think he'll help. Beg a high blood for help? Ugh. But after everything you've done, I can't refuse. But for now, I'm bound for Sunfall. Be safe. So, you know, fast travel. Oh, okay, a little more stressful than I would thought. Dude was super tanky. Like, super tanky. It was interesting. Dude had rocket launchers. I didn't even. Oh my god, fucking rocket launchers. Okay. So, found me here. How we gonna do this? Go talk to the barn. Don't forget to stock up before you're on the road. Like what I have for sale, I promise. A man named Nissan came to see me, and we came to an arrangement. I think many in Sunfall will benefit from it. All this from a stolen sword, as they say. Follow the shadow, and you'll find the flame. I'm not too sure about that. All right. All right. 
Let's open this box. That being said, guys, I hope you guys enjoyed this. Uh, whew. Today was this was a long, a longer episode than usual. I feel like. But with that being said, I hope you guys enjoy. And always remember to always stay icy, and in whatever you do, always improve. With that being said, I'm gonna see you guys next week. Deuces. <laughs>